Hey, it's Roger here. Gonna hit this this here spot. Show them the spot here. The spot was some 800 grit sandpaper. Get it nice and scuffed. If you cannot paint over any surface that are not prepped, this way you get some good adhesion with your paint. Just kidding, my name is Booney. Roger's my alter ego. Nice and prepped out here. Go a little bit further than your, your area that's got missing paint so you can blend in your clear here. You want to grab some tar and wax remover, get any contaminants off of that spot. Tar and wax, make sure there ain't no contaminants. Kind of wipe your molding here. I'm not gonna mask anything off, it's just quick and easy here. Got a cheap little mini gun setup, uh, Euro gun, 130 bucks at your local auto body store. There's some paint here that I already mixed up by paint code. Pretty good match or good enough. Load that up. Turn my PSI, PSI down a little bit. You want this on airbrush mode. Kind of blow some light color in there. Get some coverage. No primers, no fillers, quick, easy fix. I'm probably running on maybe 15, 16 PSI right now. Let that first coat dry. Kind of lightly air it off. That first layer of base coat to dry, flash over. Get it to where you got good coverage. Let that dry, clean out my gun here. I'll leave that there. Got some cheap U pull clear. You can use like model car clear works. Some exalted clear blenders as you melt the new clear into the old clear. The base coat isn't all the way dry yet. Grab my gun, I'll build the clear on that.
working on a little heavy, so it's taking a little bit longer to back up here. Clear coat here. We're just gonna go over the spots that we hit and a little bit over, and that's it. Don't go too much or you will run it. Now we'll melt that in. Simple and easy.